a squad a score here if you want to take this game serious the links in the description below so be sure to check them out for more resources and information let's get started he binds i use i bind said to jump throw this bind is needed uh, to be able to execute uh, good utility stacks uh, you have to place it in your auto x uh, i'll show you how to do it how to find your auto x file if you already have one it's easy a step to write and let the computer do the work and then open a folder and you find the folder but uh, if you haven't done one yet you go into the steam folder steam apps common uh, count strike game C csgo was in csgo now it's game and then csgo and then config and then you make your folder here and you put in uh, the commands uh, that this required uh, you have the jump throw you have the shift bind uh, this one is to mute uh, toggle uh, my voice off I also have a keybind for every utility. Uh, you bind it like this. You have flash nade, molotov, and smoke. Keybind your bind menu. This is a personal preference. Uh, I like not to interrupt in the beginning of the round because that's normally when you talk uh, about what you're going to do and how you're going to play that round. So I prefer to have all my buy options uh, key binded. So I use my arrow keys to buy utility. F1 to F2 to buy armor or armor and helmet. F3 to F11 to buy weapons and F12 to buy diffuse kit. Player ping keybind can be good to highlight weapons on the ground after the round is over or by double pressing the ping key bind you will give a warning signal i have it binded to x but you can find whatever key you like to use it on uh, you can also find it in settings i also have a, an adjustment on my shift key uh, to basically double my volume whenever i hold shift this is useful if i'm uh, far back on a site and want to get information i just keep on holding shift basically i have a keybind to switch side of my weapons sometimes this can be favorable if you're holding a close angle uh, i use my middle mouse to toggle between right and left hand these are the keybinds i use for when i practice smoke and utility in practice mode Everything is found in the information section below the video. Game launch properties. And then go into launch options and write in these commands do not put the uh, max fps on zero i believe it uh, gives you some uh, it gives some input lag it's better to have it on a fixed uh, higher number if you want to play with really high fps plus rate is very important uh, it's basically bandwidth rate uh, this command is set uh, the maximum data rate in bytes per second at which your game client can receive data from the server in this case uh, 786432 it is important to note that uh, this setting won't help you if you have a really bad connection i would appreciate it if you liked commented and subscribed and hit the notification bell uh, you will see more guides getting out and uh, additional content if i have time I spent a lot of uh, hours 
uh, editing and trying to come up with ideas on how to present things. So, see you.